Hello everybody and welcome back to another Marvel's Avengers weekly cosmetic news and marketplace update. I really hope everybody's doing fine. I'm doing fine. We are here. We're on time. We're getting it done. All right. So let's go ahead and check out this exclusive community challenge, which is defeat 1 million watchdogs. Reward Kate Bishop nameplate 58. Now these weekly challenges are the priority missions condition green and up from the depths. Priority harm challenges, first time completion reward, Captain America 1986, issue 313. Now the harm challenges, do keep this in mind, it's the only the first time completion that you complete the two different harm challenges that they have this week. And that's the lower power one and the higher power one. Once you complete those and you try to do it again for the same comic, you will not. You might be able to get it, but it will be a random drop. Next we have the Mega Hive, which is the Gauntlet. And you'll be facing eight hives that are four le six four levels. And you have to have heroes power 140 to 150. Any hero that gets dropped during that completion of the Mega Hives, you will lose. So if you have like three heroes that are 150 and the other ones are lower than that, or 140 and are lower, then you're only going to be able to use those three heroes. Now, if one of those heroes drop during, let's say, the third hive that you're on, you're only allowed to use the other two heroes that you have at that level for the rest of it. If all your heroes drop, you have to start all over at the first hive again. So do keep that in mind. It's not too bad. I've done it with one hero and two heroes before, so you should be fine. All right, let's go ahead and check this marketplace. We have Hulk Gladiator. Yeah, this one I really enjoy. I think next new clit is it gonna have your forge that oh my god this one looks sick Iron Man Prophetium I don't know I like this though Thor unworthy I don't know you guys have to tell me more about this one it's kinda cool I like his arm did something happen to his arm America Valiant Honor now, a lot of cap costumes look the same. That's what kind of sucks. You can't really do too much with the same costume over and over again. But don't fear itself. Like I told you, the PlayStation has no problem loading these ones, but when it comes to this cosmetic vendor, you see it has trouble loading those ones for some reason. Got Miss Marvel, Blue Fathom. Okay, I'm liking a lot of these costumes. Look at the ones down here. We have classic styles for Black Widow. Every time I hear that, I think like, Take me home to the city where the grass is green and the girls are petty. We got Breakthrough for the Hulk. Now this one is an Iron Whip. I think you can earn this one too playing the campaign, so do keep that in mind. I could be wrong. You got Thor, Asgard, Might. Right, let's see, we got all costumes this week. Usually there's some knee playing system cake takedowns around here. We have Kate Miss Marvel. I mean, not Kate, Miss Marvel, Greater Good. I was like, what? Kate, Miss Marvel? What am I talking about over here, huh? I do remember you could always press the R2 button to get into a hero roster and see what specific items are available for your hero in the marketplace this week. Sometimes they change, sometimes it's the same. They rarely change, but they do change. I know that doesn't make sense. So let me put that in other words. They do change, but not so often very rarely do they change or rotate the items you can get in the hero roster of the marketplace if that sounds better i'll meet you guys in the cosmetic vendor and again eating an invincible godly fruit yeah that's door for you all right let's go ahead and check that cosmetic vendor yes yes <laughs> outfit but you definitely want one right now the specialty items on the bottom will rotate every week seven days as you can see six days and 22 hours left the thing is I feel like 
they barely rotate these. Now, you guys let me know, the ones who have been following me and watching this, how many times have we seen this pinstripe now? This has been like the... It's been here since I've started doing these videos, I swear. The Lorraine Strode is an awesome costume. I mean, it's not Lorraine Strode. I call it Lorraine Strode, but it just calls me Lorraine. Laura or Laura. But it reminds me of Laura Strode from Michael Myers. It's an awesome costume. Let's see if we can preview it. If not, I'm sorry. I'm going to check it out. Oh. You know, Dead by Daylight status. All right. And we got On Target for Kate Bishop. Mm, no, it doesn't work. All right. Well, it's basically a right, a white hoodie. I think she has like some blue jeans and then like a little purple target on the on the sweater. Up here are the cosmetic items. These will reset every day. You'll have some costumes. You'll have some nameplates. You'll also have some emotes. You get these with regular green units, even the specialty items. So you don't have to purchase these with real money. You can actually earn this just by looting the crates and doing the challenge cards, challenges, etc. Doing also priority missions will get you some currency for things that you might like. And also those mega hives help a lot. All right. Pretty much going to wrap it up for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for taking your time to watch. And if you guys want, go ahead and fun Chastity's McBride's coffee habit. And until next time, in about a week, I'm going to try to catch you guys for that Clint storyline stream as always. I really hope you guys enjoy. If you guys miss me, haven't checked out some of my content, want to see some funny stuff, head over to that Drug by Daylight that we did a couple of days ago. Thank you so much for taking your time to watch. Shout out to my donators and supporters. Coco Games, Lestat, Nani, S4, Honor, uh, Dre. I feel like I'm forgetting somebody. I really hope I'm not. Love you all. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching.